six tigers can catch just six rabbits in six minutes so how many tigers will be needed to catch 60 rabbits in 60 minutes the immediate answer will be 60 but however that is not the right answer with mathematics there is always something under the carpet you have to look close feel free to pause the video and give a try before checking the solution once done continue watching the video for the right answer Let me explain the solution now. There is a general formula approach and logical approach to solve this problem. I will explain both. Uh, let me explain the formula approach first. If M1 number of people can do W1 work in D1 days working T1 hours each day and M2 number of people can do W2 work in D2 days working t2 hours each day then the relation between them will be m1 times d1 times t1 over w1 equals m2 times d2 times t2 over w2 so here in this problem the given information is six tigers can catch just six rabbits in six minutes so what we are supposed to find is the number of tigers which is required to catch 60 rabbits in 60 minutes so for this problem there are only three variables hence formula can be uh, written as m1 d1 over w1 equals m2 d2 over w2 where m is number of workers d is number of days hours minutes seconds and w is piece of work here catching rabbit is considered as work done by tiger so m1 equals 6 d1 equals 6 and w1 equals 6 m2 is what we are supposed to find d2 is equal to 60 and w2 equals 60 now after substituting all the values the equation becomes 6 times 6 over 6 equals m2 times 60 over 60 after solving this we get m2 equals 6 therefore 6 tiger will be needed to catch 60 rabbits in 60 minutes and this is the formula based approach Sometimes the formula is not required in order to solve this problem. Uh, so let me explain the other ways to solve this puzzle without using formula. So one way is, uh, so the given information as we already know that is 6 tigers can catch 6 rabbits in 6 minutes. According to this statement, 1 tiger can catch 1 rabbit in 6 minutes. In 60 minutes, each tiger can catch 10 rabbits. So each tiger can catch 10 rabbits in 60 minutes. But there are 6 tigers, hence 6 tigers can catch 60 rabbits in 60 minutes. So this is the straightforward approach. There is an alternative method. So consider again the given information which is 6 tigers can catch just 6 rabbits in 6 minutes. So it is said in the question that 6 tigers can catch 6 rabbits in 6 minutes. If you multiply it by 10, the same tigers can catch 60 rabbits in 60 minutes. So the answer will be 6. So these are the logical ways of looking into the problem and this is good way to solve the problem if the statements given are easy and variables are minimal. But if the given problem is difficult then it is better to go with formula approach in order to avoid any kind of mistakes. That's all for this video. Let me know if you have any questions. I will try to address as soon as possible. Thanks for watching. Let's meet in the next video with one more interesting problem. Thank you.